and welcome back to Moving with Meredith. Today's class is a 45-minute breath-based Hatha yoga class for all levels. All you need for this class is a yoga mat, a nice space to move in, and maybe a pillow or something to prop your hips up on. Hatha yoga unites the two polarities of sun and moon, body movement and breath movement into one seamless flow. Let's begin by taking our pillow and placing it underneath our sitting bones. This is important to slightly tilt the pelvis forward, placing the knees nice and firm on the mat and sitting in a comfortable position. Once you feel situated, close the eyes, sit up nice and tall from the base of the spine all the way lengthening through the top of the head, relaxing the shoulders, the face, the jaw, and finding your own firm, still sitting position. We'll come into a moment of silence, of inner peace and stillness. Slowly begin to notice your breath. The inhale as your chest lifts, the exhale as your belly relaxes, finding the natural expansive breath. Gently come back into the space, keeping your eyes closed. And from here, we'll go ahead and bring our hands to our heart center and form an intention for the rest of this practice. What is your intention? Gently drop the hands to either side, slowly open the eyes, and come back into the space. The breath that we use in Hatha Yoga is known as Ujjayi breath, or ocean breath. So we'll practice by lifting our hand and creating a <sighs> noise with our mouth open. Go ahead and practice. And make sure that you're closing your mouth when you do it within the practice. So we inhale through the nostrils, ocean breath, and exhale with our mouth closed, ocean breath. Let's go ahead and practice that on our own one more time. So inhaling through the nose with the mouth closed, ujjayi, and exhaling with the mouth closed, Ujjayi. Beautiful. So we will continue this breath throughout the entire practice. Let's go ahead and stand up and start. Coming to the center of our mat with our feet nice and parallel, we'll start with a short breath and body warm up. So placing our feet nice and parallel, lengthening through the top of the spine all the way up through the head, and we'll begin with our Ujjayi breath. 
So coming into mountain, inhale, arms up, shoulders down. Exhale, ujjayi, arms down. Inhale. Look up, reach up. Exhale. Two more breaths. Inhale, moving the arms up, shoulders down, look up. Exhale, relax the arms down. Inhale, reaching the arm up, greeting the sky. And exhaling. This time we'll come into a nice forward fold. Padahastasana, relaxing the neck. And inhale, reaching everything up. Ujjayi. Exhale, forward fold. Relax the head. Inhale, reaching up. Ujjayi. Exhale, two more times. Forward fold. Inhale, reaching arms up. Last time, exhale, forward fold. And inhale, slowly reaching the arms up, greeting the sky, and relaxing the arms down by your side. Take a nice deep inhale and exhale. From here, we'll go ahead and start our six sun salutations. So standing in parallel at the front of our mat, keeping our shoulders nice and down, lengthening from the bottom of the feet all the way to the spine. You can just watch for the first round if that feels comfortable and then join. So exhaling, bring your hands to heart center. Inhale, ujjayi, reach up, look up. Exhale, forward fold, fingertips. Inhale, reaching the left leg back, look up. Exhale, dropping back into do it, downward dog. Breath retention, tabletop, knees, chest, and chin. Inhale, cobra, keeping the feet nice and strong on the mat. Exhale, down to downward dog. And again, inhaling left leg, low lunge, chest up. Exhale, coming into forward fold, relaxing the head. Inhale, reaching up, lifting with the arms. And exhale, coming back to heart center. We'll go ahead and transition to the right side. And inhale, reaching arms up, look up. Exhale, forward fold, fingertips to toes. Inhale, reach the right leg back, look up. Exhale, all the way down to downward dog, keeping the hips nice and strong, lifted. Breath or tension, knees, chest, and chin. Inhale, ujjayi, cobra. Exhale, long, deep ujjayi, downward dog. Inhale, reach, lift the right leg back up, low lunge. Exhale, forward fold, relaxing the head. Inhale, reaching both arms up. And exhale, dropping back to our heart center. We have four more of these. Here we go. Inhale, reach up, greet the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, left leg back, look up, low lunge. Exhale, downward dog, lifting the hips up, pushing with the arms. Breath or tension, knees, chest, and chin. And inhale, cobra. Exhale, coming all the way back to downward dog. Lifting the hips and inhale, left leg, look up, chest up. Exhale, forward fold, dropping the head. And inhale, deep swan dive up. And exhale, back to arms. Inhale, ujjayi, lift, look up. Exhale, swan dive, forward fold. Inhale, right leg back, look up, chest open. Exhale, downward dog, lifting the hips. Breath or tension, knees, chest, and chin. And inhale, cobra. Exhale, dropping all the way down, downward dog. Inhale, right leg forward. Chest up, look up. Exhale, forward fold, dropping the head. And inhale, reaching the arms up. Relaxing the arms down, back to center. Two more times, inhale, reaching up. Exhale, deep ujjayi breath. Inhale, step back, left leg. And back to downward dog, lifting the hips up, pushing into the mat. Breath or tension, knees, chest, and chin. And inhale, cobra up. From here, exhale, downward dog, lifting the hips. 
And left leg steps forward, reaching up, low lunge, chest open. Both feet together, forward fold. Inhale, reaching up, arms up. Exhale and come back to center. Last one, inhale, reach up, greet the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, right leg back, low lunge. All the way down, downward dog, pushing into the mat. Breath retention, knees, chest, and chin. Reaching up with the spine, cobra. Exhaling, downward dog. And inhale, right leg, step through, low lunge. Exhale, forward fold. And inhale, reaching up with both arms. Extending and closing with the arms at heart center. Relax the hands and take a few natural breaths. Feeling the gentle effects of our sun salutations, the usage of our breath with the body movement, and then coming out of that. Next, we'll come into our first posture, which is Parahastasana or forward fold. Inhale, reach both arms up, forward fold, exhale, fingertips to the toes. Again, dynamically, inhale, reaching both arms up, chest up, shoulders down, exhale, ujjayi, fingertips to toes. Two more times, dynamically, inhale, reaching up with the spine, exhale, ujjayi, fingertips to toes. And last time, inhale, reaching up with the head, arms nice and long, and exhale, forward fold. From here, we're gonna stay for four breaths. Statically, we stay. Inhale, lifting as the chest opens, and exhale, staying down. You can bend your knees or shift your weight slightly forward. Exhaling, ujjayi. Two more breaths. Inhaling. Exhaling. Last ujjayi breath here. And inhale, both arms up, exhaling the arms to either side and feeling the effects with a natural inhale and exhale of the breath. Beautiful and relaxing. From here, we'll come into our next asana, which is Trikonasana or triangle pose. So coming to the front of your mat in a nice parallel position, reaching with your right foot back at a 90 degree angle. And front foot is nice and forward at the short edge of the mat. Inhale, reach the arms up and lengthen through the spine as you exhale, ujjayi breath. Ocean breath, reaching the arm up, look up at the arm and dynamically come back to center. Inhaling, exhale, ujjayi, reaching up, look up at the sky and inhale, dynamically back to center, reaching with the back foot. Exhale, forward, reach up, looking up, long spine, inhale, coming back up, again, exhale, forward fold, lifting, looking up, and back to center. Last time here, so reaching nice and long, exhaling, and we'll come into our static portion of the pose. So holding for four ujjayi breaths, inhaling deeply, ujjayi. Exhaling deeply, ujjayi. Feel what's right for you. You can hold your thigh if you need to. Reaching with that back foot, nice and strong. You can also relax your neck here if that feels better. And inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, and come to the front of your mat, relaxing with a natural breath. This time we'll take our left foot behind us for Trikonasana. So making sure our front foot is nice and parallel to the short edge of the mat, and our back foot is 90 degrees. Reaching the arms forward, lifting inhale, and exhale as we come into four dynamic breathings. 
reaching with the sky and inhaling back to center. Exhale, ujjayi, dropping the chest forward. Look up and inhale back to center. Beautiful. And again, exhale, reaching, lengthening through the spine and the back leg and inhaling back to center. Last time, exhale, ujjayi, reaching nice and long with the spine. And you can either look up with the head or keep your head neutral. Lengthen through the back leg and do those static four ujjayi breaths. Beautiful. Relax the neck and inhale back to center and close the position by coming back to parallel. Taking a breath in and out. We'll transition to our next asana, which is wide leg forward fold. So take your right leg nice and long behind you. Legs are parallel and we'll inhale four dynamic breaths falling forward. Exhale, folding, relax the neck, folding from the hips, and inhale, coming back up, reach up, shoulders down. Exhale, dynamically, relax the neck, and inhale, reach up. You can always plie your legs here. Exhale, forward fold, relaxing the neck. Inhale, lifting through the spine, shoulders down. And last time, forward fold from the hips, relaxing the neck. We'll stay here for four static breaths. So inhaling deeply through the chest, lifting, lengthening, and exhaling, allowing the spine to fold over even more. And inhale, deep ujjayi, lift up towards the sky, and exhale, relax the arms. Coming to a nice parallel position, taking a natural breath in and out. We'll come into our next asana, which is Virabhadrasana 2, or Warrior 2. Stepping your right foot back and rotating all the way to face that right foot. Inhale, lift both arms up keeping your back foot nice and parallel to the short edge of the mat. We'll take a deep breath as we exhale and inhale back up. So gently just bending the knee and then coming back to center. We'll have two more breaths here. So exhale dynamically, nice and parallel knee and inhale, reaching with the back arm, lengthen those arms, exhale, and then we'll stay here for our four static breaths. So keeping the arms nice and long, extending the back foot, and knee is nice and bent. Utilizing that breath, deep, deep ujjayi breaths. And coming back to center, We'll go ahead and switch to the opposite side. So left foot, inhale, reaching both of our arms out to either side, shoulders down and lengthen in the spine. Exhale, four dynamic breaths here and inhale, lifting up. Exhale, ujjayi, nice and juicy plie. And inhale, back up to center. Two more. Beautiful, last one. We'll stay here for our four static breaths. Reaching, lengthening the arms, keeping the gaze at the horizon. Nice and long back leg. Four dynamic breaths.
Inhale, coming back to center and taking a deep, natural inhale and exhale as you come to parallel. Relax the shoulders and feel the effects of the posture. We'll make our way into our last standing posture, which is tree pose. So feet are nice and parallel, long spine. We'll put our weight on our left leg, placing the foot at our ankle or calves or all the way up at our thigh. So right foot is up and we'll take a deep inhale and exhale heart center. We'll come to our four dynamic movements. Inhale, lifting the arms up, shoulders down. Exhale, ujjayi back to center. Three more. Inhale, lift up, greet the sky. And exhale, ocean breath, heart center. Coming back to heart center, we'll go ahead and lift our hands back up for our static four breaths. You can also leave your hands at heart center. So inhaling deep ujjayi and exhaling deep ujjayi for four breaths. It's always good to pick something to look at so your balance is nice and strong. Beautiful, relaxing the arms to heart center and then taking your right leg, turning it in and bringing it down back to parallel. We'll go ahead and go into the opposite side. So this time placing your weight towards your right leg, lifting the left leg at the calf or the thigh and then finding the right position for you. Your hips should be facing forward, arms lifting, inhale, ujjayi. Exhale, back to heart center. Three more dynamically with the breath. Shoulders down. Last one, reaching up towards the sky. Shoulders down and exhaling ujjayi back to heart center. You can stay at heart center or you can lift the arms, keeping the shoulders down and staying for your four static breaths. Deeply inhaling ujjayi and exhaling ujjayi ocean breath. Beautiful. Relaxing the arms back to heart center and then relaxing the knee inward and down. Beautiful. Coming to the front of our mat, we're going to go ahead and come to parallel and make a transition down towards the floor. So we're going to go ahead and inhale, ujjayi, reach both arms up, look up. Exhale, forward fold, relaxing from the hips. Inhale, extended forward fold, flat back. And exhale, forward fold, this time stepping all the way back to downward dog with both legs. Reach up nice and high with the pelvis, push into both arms, and we're going to stay here for five ujjayi breaths. Breathing nice and deeply, inhale, lengthening, and exhale, folding even more. You can always bend your knees, relax the spine and push up with those hips. And coming into our last breath, we'll move forward into a tabletop position and then come all the way down to child's pose relaxing the neck and the upper body. From here, we'll go to a lovely sequence flow. You can just watch if you'd like the first time and then we'll do it together. So inhale, reaching both arms up, look up, all the way on the knees and then exhale back to child's pose. 
Inhale, rolling through Ujjayi breath to Cobra. Elbows are nice and tucked. Exhale, coming back to Child's Pose. So go ahead and join me if you haven't already. Inhale, reaching arms up, knees. Exhale, Child's Pose. And rolling through. Inhale, Cobra. Elbows are nice and tucked. Feet on the mat. And exhale, all the way, Child's Pose. Inhale, reaching up, shoulders down, look up. Exhale, child's pose. And inhale, rolling through, cobra, lifting the chest. And exhaling all the way back to child's. Inhale, lifting last time, reach up. Exhale, ujjayi. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, childs. Stay here for a moment, taking a nice natural breath in and out. Gently come out of the child's pose and we'll make our way to a sitting position. From here, we're going to Navasana or boat pose. So sitting nice and tall in those sitting bones, opening the chest. You do not have to do this posture if you have an injured back. So reaching, lengthening the spine, and from here we're going to exhale the legs up, reaching with the arms. Inhale, lift and lengthen the legs. Exhale, come back down. Inhale, reaching, and exhale, bending the knees. Two more. Inhale, utilize the core in the chest. Exhale, back to center. Last time, inhale, reaching. Exhale, back to center. From here, we're going to stay for our static. Inhale, just four deep ujjayi breaths, holding, reaching, and lengthening. You've got this. It's okay to shake a little. And exhale, relax the legs down and come back to center. You can even take your arms behind you and just relax with the natural breath for a moment, feeling the effects of the posture. From here, we're going to transition to lying on our back for bridge pose. So we'll do four dynamic breaths and four breaths holding in bridge. Walk your hands closer to your spine and your feet a little bit closer to your sitting bones. From here, we're going to take our ujjayi breath and inhale, lift both arms up above the head as you lift the pelvis up. And exhale, dynamically coming back down towards the mat. Beautiful. And inhale, ujjayi, lifting the hips and the arms above the head. Exhale, ujjayi, rolling each vertebrae. And two more times. Inhale, ujjayi. Exhale, ujjayi, rolling down. Last time, lifting, lifting the hips, reaching with the arms. And from here, we're going to hold for four static ujjayi breaths. Keep the pelvis up, squeeze the bottom, and make sure you're not splaying out with those knees. Beautiful. Exhale the arms down, rolling through the spine all the way to your flat on the mat. Gently slide down your mat and lay with a nice straight long spine. From here we're moving into Sharvangasana or shoulder stand. Please make sure that if you have an injured back or shoulders, please do not do this posture. From here, we're going to go ahead and make sure that our spine is straight. We can bend the knees slightly and make sure that your hips are in the center of your mat. You're going to press nice and long on the mat with those hands, lifting the knees and exhale as you shift up, grabbing the hips and extending those toes all the way nice and long. From here, we're going to take our ujjayi breaths and exhale one knee to the forehead 
and then lift back up nice and straight, inhaling. Exhale, dropping one knee to the forehead and inhaling back to center. Exhale, dropping. Inhaling back to center. This is all about the breath. And exhaling dynamically. Inhaling back to center. From here, we'll stay for our four static breaths. So staying, lifting nice and high, utilizing those hands on your back. Elbows are pressing and lifting into the mat and squeezing the butt. Again, it's all about the breath, deep ocean breaths. To come out, gently bend both knees and then roll vertebrae by vertebrae, supporting with your hands to help you roll down. Take your time and then eventually lie down either with your knees up or down to feel the effects of the posture. Coming into your last natural breath, in and out, and then rolling, taking your time to come onto your belly. From here, we're going to drop the forehead onto the mat and come into bow pose. So think about lengthening the spine and then reaching one arm at a time, grabbing the tops of your ankles. Make sure that you're not splaying out with your knees here. And please do not do this if you have an injured back. From here, lift up, inhale, reaching dynamically, and exhale, dropping towards the mat. It doesn't need to be very high. Inhale, bow pose, exhaling back towards the mat, kicking into those feet, inhale, exhale, and last dynamic, inhale, reaching, lifting, Exhaling, come back down. From here, inhale. We're going to stay here for four static breaths, holding nice and high. Lift and push as much as possible without injuring yourself. You know your limit. Keep breathing. Deep breaths. And Exhale, coming down flat on the mat, and then just relaxing with your forehead so that way your spine is nice and straight. Take your time to find your natural breath again. From here, we'll gently roll back to lie on our backs. We'll come into our one of our last postures, which is recline twist. So lie nice and flat and straight in the center of your mat. And from here, we'll grab our left leg with our right arm and take your left arm out to the side. From here, exhale nice and deeply over as you twist, looking the opposite direction and then come back to center, inhale. Exhale dynamically, ujjayi. Inhale, reaching back to center. Two more times. Exhale, folding and twisting. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, feeling the twist in the spine. And inhale, come back to center. From here, we'll come into our static. So exhale all the way. And then stay here for four dynamic breaths. So inhaling through the chest and exhaling as the belly drops and relaxes.
Inhale, bring the leg back to center and relax the left leg down. Taking a moment to feel the effects and then grabbing the right leg this time. So right leg is up nice and high, opposite arm is grabbing and we're twisting, facing towards the right side. Inhale, back to center and exhale dynamically folding over. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, dropping the knee. Inhale, back to center. And exhale, rotating the head, folding over. From here, we'll go ahead and stay for four static breathings. Inhaling through the chest. Exhaling through the belly. Inhale back to center and then allow that leg to nicely fall down towards the mat. From here, we'll come into our last posture. Keep the eyes closed as you sit up on your sit bones and we come into Paschimottanasana or forward fold. From here, lengthen the spine, sit up nice and tall. Inhale, ujjayi, lift up. Exhale, forward fold, keeping the chest nice and long. You can always bend the knees. Inhale, ujjayi, reach up. Exhale, keep the eyes closed and grab the feet or the ankles or the thighs. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, dynamically forward. And last time, inhale, reach up, greet the sky. Exhale, folding at the hips, forward folds. And you can always bend the knees here. We're going to stay for four last static breaths. Really breathing, inhaling through the chest, exhaling from the belly. Beautiful. Inhale, reaching one last time, greeting the sky, and exhale the arms down. From here, we're going to go into our Shavasana, or our last final resting pose. So shift down onto your mat. Allow the feet and ankles to drop. Allow the arms to have some space from the body. And fully, fully relax, closing the eyes. Relaxing the jaw, the cheeks, the eyelids, the forehead, relaxing the entirety of the whole body into total beingness, taking the next couple minutes to fully, fully relax into your own stillness and inner world.
gently come back to the body and the breath, wiggling your toes, either stretching above you or hugging your knees to your chest. And then rotating onto the side, the right side of your body, taking some time to sit in this folded position, keeping the eyes closed, and gently making your way back to a comfortable sitting position grabbing your cushion or pillow, trying to keep the eyes closed and lifting the pelvis. Once you find a comfortable position, close the eyes, relax the shoulders, lengthen the spine. And come back to that intention that you had at the beginning of class. Come back to your breath. Notice the quality of your breath. The quality of your body. And if you'd like, take a few deep ujjayi breaths, ocean breaths, inhaling deeply through the nose, holding at the top, and exhaling through the nose. Three more deep ocean breaths at your own time. Bringing your breath back to a natural breath. Feeling this gentle, expansive energy that you have created throughout this practice. And gently bringing your hands to heart center in gratitude for the practice. May all beings be held in the light and love of the universe. Bow your head in gratitude. And slowly opening your eyes, coming back to the space. Thank you so much for moving with me today on Moving with Meredith. I hope you had a wonderful 45 minutes of pure bliss. We'll see you next week. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and like this video. And we'll see you next time.